Starting off our volleyball workout, we're going seated single leg box jump to increase the rate of force development from that seated position. And obviously we can focus on some single leg power here since we're taking off one leg, landing on two. And then we pair that with our hip hinge, which will set us up for tier number two. So hip hinge just to get a good quality movement, warm up the glutes, the hamstrings, the backside, which takes us right into tier number two. Now switching from a little bit more of the velocity side to more so power. So again, we're using about roughly 50 to 60% of her max deadlifts here. So 135 pounds and we are starting from the floor. So again, she has to develop that force rapidly. So again, producing power from nothing. So again, we also go on the vertical jump mat here. So that way she gets the feedback to drive intent for these girls to increase the vertical jump for volleyball. That's the first exercise going into overhead to medicine ball slams. Again, being violent, being intentional on each of these slams for that overhead power, very similar to to serving uh, what these girls need obviously for their sport. Wrapping up our volleyball vertical jump workout, we go with single arm landmine press. Again, trying to get full body since they have very limited time. So single arm strength, it's just healthy for their shoulders in the landmine position. Single leg step ups is next. So focusing on your single leg strength and also reducing a lot of impact just from the excessive court time that they're doing. So the step up uh, again, just takes stress off their knees and ankles that gets beat up, you know, diving for balls and stuff like that, you know, during practice. Next is our inverted row. So again, just using our body weight. So I'm going underhand grip for a, a healthier shoulder position in the external rotation. So again, pulling your chest up to the bar, using their body weight, higher volume on these to strengthen their, their shoulders and their back. Our last part is pullovers and band chops. So again, we like the pullovers again for extra lat work for their shoulder health and serving power so they can hit the ball harder. And then also the uh, chops going from high to low. This is gonna train their obliques and then make sure they have a strong core for like all one, all the change of direction that they're doing, but also two, all the hitting that they're doing. So getting up overhead and then obviously rotating as they, you know, go to strike the volleyball.